Coach, as a first-year head coach, uh, what are some of the challenges that you're faced with right away? I, I imagine just learning their names, but what are you trying to get done here in the first days of cross country? Well, um, I did ask them what their goals are. They turned that in uh, today. I haven't had a chance to read them all, but just to kind of figure out where they're at, if you, they're looking at possibly a state contender or if they want to get in shape for another sport, and just, I think most of them are looking at doing personal PRs, the ones that have returned from, uh, from last year. Um, but the, the challenge is to, I think, the, uh, where they're at and where they want to go, there's a pretty wide spectrum there. Um, and just the age difference between the uh, 12th graders and 7th graders, just the talent level is a little bit different, or ability, I should say, because uh, I think they all have pretty good potential here talent-wise. So. Um, and then putting the workouts together because of their varying uh, degrees of abilities. As you look at the, some of the runners out there right now, who are some of the people that are back here that we might recognize? Uh, for sure, Tyler Sogi. Um, I think most of the ladies are, are all returning from last year. Lucas Feitels, uh, I know, is back from last year. Um, new guy, seventh grader there, Christian Nathy. Yeah, I know he can run and really enjoys it, so, yep. You know, back in the day, as you were a streeter runner, what did you take away from that that you can kind of pass along that message to these runners now of today? Um, the hard work's going to pay off. Uh, you put in the effort, and you're going you're gonna to see results, most definitely. So uh, hopefully, they, I think that's instilled in them already. They know, uh, coming off of cross country, that there's going to be some work involved running. And I guess, too, uh, no matter where you finish, you are part of the team and you have to do your job, right? Oh, ab absolutely. And and I already told these guys that, too. When, when I ran, I never won a, a meet ever. Um, and I was actually the third guy on our team uh, in the cross-country team. We had the Nortons back then. We were very good runners. But I always felt that I was contributing to the team by just uh, helping to push Lawrence. And Lawrence was pushing Ralph. And I think we all did better because of that.